Hi Prestige Indonesia, I'm Shayun Mendeluk. And I'm Alexander Mendeluk. We are the owners of the Light Force Center. And we are Light Force Healers. So the concept behind the Light Force Center came to me about five or six years ago in Los Angeles before we moved to Ibiza. And I was having these reoccurring dreams that I wanted to build a center of light on an island somewhere. And so we set out to find the island together. A few years ago, we first landed in Ibiza. That didn't work out in terms of the center, and now we're in Bali. Due to COVID, we couldn't get back to Ibiza. And so we decided to stay in Bali. And now we've created the foundation, and we have our own program, and we have our own community. And now we're creating the physical space. So I was indoctrinated, well, I was basically introduced into the world of energy and martial arts when I was a really young boy in Malibu growing up. My older brother is a martial artist, and so he would teach me things like qigong, energy work, martial arts, the discipline of the mind and the body, so I learned these things at a very young age. I was always really obsessed with the power that we have to manifest and visualization. And it was something that I always loved and I was fascinated with. I never thought it was gonna become at the forefront until I met Shayun and we began to go on this awakening journey together. Once she started healing, her gifts started emerging and she has incredible power to be able to see energy in all things. She can see it in the trees and animals in you and she can see where those ailments are and work with it. And so together we began to grow, heal ourselves and heal those around us. The basis of all healing or the light force healing and why this works so well, Western medicine would call this psychosomatic illness, a illness that comes from the psyche, right? Well, in fact, all of our illness is manifest for the most part from our thoughts, our suppressed emotions, and we hold those emotions in the body. When you learn how to remove that by A, identifying where the emotion is being held in the body, two, a series of connecting with your heart, which allows you to open up your energetic center. When you learn to then release that emotion through visualization and breath, every single person has the ability to heal themselves in this way. I would say the only challenge is when the individual doesn't show up. So if you, we always say if you're there and you commit and you do the work, then everything is possible. Um, the only challenge is when we have to face the reality that somebody doesn't want to or something's in the way of that. But luckily for us, there haven't been any major challenges and we don't look at things in that way. We seem to be in more of a flow than challenge. So whether it's with a person or a situation, I think because we are from the light that nothing is really challenging. We just make the best of whatever we can out of every situation. And use it to help you grow. Yeah.